guys, Carl Cooper here with OnTheBlack.com with just a few thoughts as the Mets head into a weekend series here with the Phillies. Uh, first, I want to go back to Wednesday's game. Uh, sixth inning, Mets made a lot of errors in that inning. Defense fell apart. Uh, Reyes, Wright, Ike Davis all making errors and eventually led to um, the loss for the Mets. You know, after that, I heard a lot of people on Twitter um, uh, saying that the Mets should look to trade either David Wright or Jose Reyes. Now, I just want to say that I think that that's the last thing that the Mets should do is look to trade either one of those guys. Um, you know, if you look at all the issues with the Mets team this year, uh, Reyes and Wright uh, should be the least of your concerns. You know, if you want to look at uh, someone on this team that's a part of the core group that the Mets maybe should look to move this offseason, you know, it should be Carlos Beltran. You know, everyone knows that I'm not the, the biggest uh, Beltran fan. But this isn't uh, really an attack on him. This is more about trying to better the team for the future and a business move. You know, Beltran uh, will be going into his last uh, season um, under his contract with the Mets in 2011. Uh, he's due to make a lot of money uh, next season, which will be a hurdle uh, if the Mets do try to look to move him. And also he has a full no trade clause, so he'd have to waive that too. But just thinking, uh, you know, from here on out the rest of the way, if Beltran can prove that he's 100% uh, healthy or close to that, and he puts up pretty decent numbers. Uh, the Mets could get a lot of uh, back for him in return if they try to move him. And, uh, you know, if you can get multiple pieces for someone like Carlos Beltran, uh, that would only go to hopefully better the team uh, overall in the future. So I definitely would not trade uh, a Jose Reyes or a David Wright right now. Um, going into the offseason, I would look to move Carlos Beltran. Uh, turning my attention to this week's game in Philadelphia, the Mets and Phillies. Uh, you know, the Mets did not have a good showing in Atlanta. And, uh, you know, they are, ready, they are really uh, backed into a corner here. Backs are against the wall. They have to play well in Philadelphia this weekend. They need to win at least two out of three. At least two out of three uh, in Philly this weekend for the Mets. You know, let's see what happens. The Phillies uh, have a lot of injuries right now, but they're still playing well. Uh, the Mets have their full team, and they're not playing well. You know, baseball works in funny ways like that sometimes. So let's see what happens this weekend. Let me know your thoughts, guys, and I'll talk to you soon.